Have you ever wondered how to navigate uncharted territory? Welcome to the world of map reading and orienteering, where every line, symbol, and color has a purpose. These skills are vital for any survivalist, adventurer, or outdoor enthusiast. In a world where digital technology often fails us in the wilderness, the ability to read a map and use a compass can be the difference between safety and danger, between being lost and finding your way. Now that you understand why these skills are essential, it's time to get into the nitty-gritty of how to master them. Map reading may seem daunting at first, but with a little practice, it can become second nature. Let's start with the basics. Every good map has a scale, which helps you understand the ratio between the map size and the actual terrain. For example, a map scale might indicate that one inch on the map equals one mile in reality. Next up is the legend or key. This is a cheat sheet for the symbols and colors used on the map. It's like a decoder ring for your map's secret language. Contour lines, those wavy lines you see, represent the shape and elevation of the terrain. They show you where the hills and valleys are and how steep they might be. Lastly, the compass rose, it's not just a pretty decoration. It tells you which way is north and helps you orient your map to match your surroundings. Remember, a map is your guide through unfamiliar terrain so understanding its language is crucial. Orienteering takes map reading one step further, adding in the element of direction. It's an adventurous sport, a survival skill, and a navigation technique all rolled into one. Picture yourself in the midst of a dense forest or on a rugged mountain trail. You have a map, a compass, and a mission. To navigate from point to point in this diverse and usually unfamiliar terrain. With orienteering, not only do you know where you are on the map, but you also know which direction to head. Now it's time to dive into the skills needed to master orienteering. When it comes to orienteering, there are a few key skills that you'll need to develop. Firstly, knowing how to use a compass is crucial. Place the compass flat on your map, aligning the compass's edge with your current location and your destination. Then, rotate the compass housing until the north lines on the compass are parallel with the north lines on the map. Next, you'll need to plot a course. Look at your map and decide the best path to your destination, considering terrain and any obstacles you might face. Lastly, following that course in the field is the real test. Use your compass to guide you along the course you plotted, regularly checking your map to ensure you're on the right track. Remember, practice makes perfect, so don't be discouraged if you don't get it right the first time. By combining map reading with orienteering, you'll be able to navigate uncharted territory like a pro.